Now I'm going to review another Tim Burton. This is a Tim Burton co-directed film. And it is the second of 2005 for Tim Burton. Um, September, this was after Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. This was September of 2005 and it is Corpse Bride. I'm going to get hate for this, but I actually like Corpse Bride more than... Nightmare Before Christmas. When I was younger, I loved Nightmare Before Christmas. As I got older, I just, you know, it just, it's good. It's just, you know what I remember, you know? Happens a lot. People would like, you know, Hocus Pocus and all those other good, you know, all those other movies. So, Nightmare Before Christmas is still good because, you know, stop motion, fantastic, fantastic animation. I just always like this a little bit more. Now, this is uh, produced by Joe Ram, who, you know, sadly, sadly, uh, killed in an automobile accident, kind of like Bob Clark. This is actually, I believe, a year before Bob Clark, uh, Bob Clark's uh, um, accident. But uh, this is actually a good movie because. You have Johnny Depp in this, which I gotta say, <laughs> at least he got better after uh, what we've seen uh, in Charlie and Chocolate Factory. But, um, you know, he played a good character who must, you know, there's this big thing with this, with this whole movie. And I like the whole thing with between you know, dead and alive, and I, I love that, that whole atmosphere, the music that Danny Elfman does, remember this man, it's kind of cool how he did two fantastic soundtracks, um, at least from what I know from that year, the Trial of Chalk Factory and this, and you got Michael Gove in this, you got the, that, uh, Really attractive uh, woman who played the witch, the the good witch from the witches from 1990. She's in this. Um, Tracy Ullman is in this. Richard E. Grant is in this. Emily Watson is in this. Helena Bonham Carter, in my opinion, stole the show. Um, Deep Roy was awesome in this. You know, and I always, I love the Siddler. I love the part where the humans contact, like, you know, mingle with the dead. I love that part. Like, that's probably my favorite part of the, the you know, movie where it's a scary, you know, figure. And a little boy goes, Papa. You know, I, I love that. And then the the old the elderly lady I haven't seen you in years, I I loved those. You know things with the dead and alive. I know that was so spectacular how they did that, and if you look at movies a lot a lot of movies that um, are kind of like that was supernatural and stuff that for the kids, but you know I can name off a lot, but. You know what I mean? Burton did what a lot of these people did not do. And I'm talking about um, big, you know, big people. Like, big name people. They don't even know how to... They, a lot of these people didn't. And Tim Burton actually knew how to do this with with, with these characters. Um, <clears throat> so I like liked it because of that. Christopher Lee is amazing as the pastor. Like... You have so many really good parts out of this. And yeah, kids watching, if you're kind of, but it just goes like, and it just, it feels like a real, like, it's like literally like a roller coaster ride going down in like Disney or something. It's, it's spectacular in my opinion. Flawless flick, flawless.